Good day, sir. Good day, sir. My name is Xavier Ford. I was wondering if uh, you might be able to help me. I have a close friend who happens to be in a dire strait of pain. Oh, of course. Uh, welcome to my apothecary. Do come in. Would you like to have some tea first, sir? Do sit down. <clears throat> As a matter of fact, I would. Your tea is here, sir. Huh. Thank you, sir. Mm -hmm. the, uh, it's a bit warm. How can I help you today, sir? You said that you have someone that is in need of a particular potion. Yes. Uh, well... Do you have perhaps a prescription, or is what's his his ailments? Um, as a matter of fact, I have been handed a list of things that, when they pointed me towards you, are supposed to possibly help him. Um, well, certainly we'll do what I can. So let's see what he has. Use your discretion on it, of course. Of course. Ah, signed by Doctor Ravencroft. Yes, fine man. Mm. Well, you seem to see eye to eye on a lot of alchemical equations, of course. He spoke highly of you. He was the one that trained me. <laughs> ah, that explains that. Mm. Interesting. By the way this sounds, if I'm understanding his symptoms, it could be a parasite, perhaps worms. Quite possibly. Mm. I've noticed he can't stay out of the loo very much. Mm, mm, mm. And as far as the dry skin and hydration, I think a simple rose water tonic can help him. I have some white pine needle tea. Uh, it's fresh from the white pine, uh, albeit it's been here for a couple of days. It's uh, It still has its potency. I can make him a simple tonic. Um, it actually has five times more vitamin C than a regular lemon, believe it or not. Mm -hmm. Sounds good. And as far as his worms is concerned, Artemisia absinthium, the common wormwood. If uh, you would be so patient as to wait for a moment, I will get to the lab and I will make this as soon as possible. Should it take about, I don't know, 45 minutes at best. Certainly, sir. Thank you. Hmm. Oh, I do love Earl Grey. It's very good.
Sir Absent One. I think his friend will like that. this young man this is a storage box mm -hmm. it has all the potions and 
the tees and loose leaf. It's all bagged up. Um, With the instructions inside, I suppose. Of course. Thank you. I usually use that as like a deposit box for certain clientele. Business has been slow because, well, people are learning what I do. <laughs> so, well, we you will make sure that. that this is brought back to you within in full tact. Excellent. After we deliver such things to him. Uh, is there any other instructions for me? If you would, just bring the box back and um, I'll fill up any orders as needed. Absolutely. Uh, what shall I say it cost you? Oh, uh, probably about three gold, I would say. Excellent. Certainly, I happen to have that very amount with me. <clears throat> I believe you shall find this. It's very sufficient for your funding. Excuse me. I assure you, it's all there. Um, sir, this is very generous, but are you sure this is more than three gold? I have need of your expertise, I suppose. Um, I have places of distribution that uh, would require a man of your talents. I will be more than happy to oblige to this contract, sir. Absolutely. I shall forward you the names and places of which um, could use your talent. That's very generous. No problem, sir. I shall bid you adieu. I am off to see more people today. Thank you so much for your services and thank you so much for the old grey. Yes, of course. I greatly appreciate it. Mm -hmm. I shall deliver this to my good friend. Thank you. Thank you so much for stopping by, sir. Thank you for your services. And uh, we shall return on the morrow with your box. Thank you, Thank you very much. much. Good day. Be safe journey. Yes, Very generous. <laughs> Why is it every time I have Earl Grey, every morning starts out great? Thank you.